Welcome to Digital Asset News Clips, where we take the advancements in cryptocurrency and digital assets and bring them out of bite-sized pieces. Today, we're going to talk about uh, an old nemesis of ours called scams and how it's uh, rearing its ugly head, not just for the average retail investor in crypto, but also across the whole spectrum that is YouTube, and it's uh, leading to uh, channels being shut down. And uh, this is what happens when you become uh, too reactive instead of proactive, and in my humble opinion, I think YouTube could have done a heck of a lot more uh, than what they did. So what is going on here? So this is uh, Graham Stephen. I don't really watch his channel, uh, but it came up and I was like, ooh, that's a pretty catchy title. And uh, I, I clicked on it and it was pretty interesting. And he just talks about uh, how his channel may be deleted. And then he goes through about why he thinks it's gonna, gonna happen. Yeah, and then I kind of did my own research and took a look at some uh, prominent crypto YouTubers and what's going on with them. And then I took a look at uh, what could be done. And then I just ended up with what I'm actually doing to combat all these scammers on my channel so you don't have to deal with it in the comment section. So uh, first of all, let's just talk about this guy here. This is uh, Graham Stephen, and he came on uh, July 2nd and said that his channel is going to be deleted. Personally, I don't think it's going to be deleted. He's got like 3 million subscribers, doubtful. I'm pretty sure he's got a good, strong pipeline into YouTube and he's going to be fine. However, it is concerning that what happened was that he woke up one day and he got this nice little... Uh, message across his his uh, information box in YouTube studio. It says, hey, and this is from uh, YouTube, we've seen uh, a lot of comment spams, a lot of spam comments from your channel. Unless you immediately stop all spam activities, your channel will be terminated on July 12th, which is tomorrow. Today is July 11th, 2021. So uh, rightfully so, he's a little bit uh, uh, perplexed going, why did that happen to me? I don't do anything wrong. And then uh, he got an email which was directly to his email. Not like he just found this email, this was directly to him. It says, hi, Graham Stephen. Wanna let you know our team has detected repeated or severe comment spam from your account, which is a violation of our spam, deceptive practices and scans policy, letting you know, in case you might realize it's a violation of our policy. So this was the whole thing. And uh, it's a bummer if you're gonna get your, your channel uh, you know, taken down. What's even more of a bummer though, is all the people that have been screwed out of their money uh, because YouTube allows us on their platform because they own the platform, let's, let's be honest. And I'm not saying that it's not a great platform. Look, it gives me a voice. It gives uh, you know, thousands, hundreds of thousands of people out there a voice. Whereas in other countries, you don't get this voice. Look at China. Uh, that is how it is. So in that regard, I'm very thankful for that. But just because they do one great thing doesn't mean they get a pass on everything. That's just how businesses work. And in this one, they really dropped the ball. So what Graham kind of came out is he said, okay, I have this, this theory as to why I'm going to have my channel deleted. He goes, first of all, he thought, well, it's because I, I've been commenting too many things in my comment section. Like he'll say like, hey, great job, or thanks for, thanks for watching the video, which is great, you know, good for him. He, he takes the time to do that. Asked, and he thought maybe that was just too much. Then he took a look at uh, the information that had made no, absolutely no sense. And then he started to think about this. He said, well, this would make sense. It's because, and, and this is in my channel and every other crypto YouTuber I talk to, is he gets uh, people that have his exact same name, his exact same profile pic, and they'll say stupid stuff like this. Like, hey, contact one blah, blah, blah to WhatsApp and I'll tell you how to make a ton of money, right? And before you start laughing, this happens all the time and people get busted. I know people are like, how stupid are people? You don't understand. You are cursed with knowledge. You know what's going on. You know what time it is in the crypto space. But people getting new to this, and especially like think of like the, you know, like people who aren't really tech savvy or just are just naive. It happens every, there's a sucker born every minute, unfortunately. And this is what's happening. So he thought for himself, he's like, well, it's just because of all these different Graham Stevens that are being created. And then he thought, well, maybe it's because you know, my, uh, my name was used. And so they rounded all up, all the Graham Stevens or, or uh, a different variation of the name and said, hey, all 10 million of you, uh, we're gonna just ban your channel. And at first glance, that would make sense, right? You just think, oh, it's Graham Steven, uh, Graham Steven one, Graham Steven two, Graham Steven one million. We're just gonna ban them all, right? That's not how it works. And this is why, this is what's going on. So this is how scammers do things. What they do is this is MM Crypto, okay? And I just picked up a random uh, crypto YouTuber and he was the first one that came up with his big head and, and uh, uh, that type of thing. Sorry, MM Crypto, that's exactly how you do all your thumbnails. Anyhow, so scrolling down, 
we go for, I have a big head too, it's okay. So go, scrolling down, we'll take a look at uh, all the different comments here. And usually it's not in like the first comment for some reason, that's what I've seen. Like these are just random comments from like, you know, real people, great. But usually it's like the second, third or fourth or 17th or 25th comment under the replies, you're gonna see stupid stuff like this. Uh, pinned by MM Crypto, right? And it says, thanks for watching WhatsApp, blah, blah, blah. And then even if you scroll down, let's see, you'll probably see it again. And then maybe you under here might see it again. Yeah, you'll see it again. You'll see it again and again and again and again, right? Because that's what scammers do. They're just, they just generate these bots. They spawn these bots and they go across everything and they just pick up all the different information and they just insert their comments because they don't need to get everybody. They just gotta get one. And that one person is gonna give them all their crypto or all their money or some of their money, it doesn't really matter. So here's why I say this doesn't make any sense because for every one of these, you have if you click on this, it'll take you to the actual YouTube channel that is associated with this account because you have to associate an account with every single uh, YouTube uh, membership or, or, or YouTube uh, username. And with this one, if you wanna make a channel, you can do that and it goes to your, your YouTube account. So like in this one, you see this channel doesn't have any content, right? But if you look at the real MM Crypto, he's got a ton of content, 427,000 subscribers. Wow, good for you, man. And uh, so there's a ton of stuff. So every single one like this, all it is is a program that generates the email and it creates a, a YouTube page, which will say like, go to this page or whatever else. But this has nothing to do, even if, you're, if your name is Graham Steven, Graham Steven, Graham Steven, or even if your name is Digital Asset News and you have a thousand of them, they're going to send that email to this account. And I can tell you right now that this account isn't mmcrypto at gmail.com or whatever else. It's probably something like, um, I don't know, Tony Vasis uh, crypto scammer <laughs> at gmail.com. Cause every email that you put in there, you can put that email in and you can change your, uh, YouTube username and that's it. And then you can have, you can do this in, in, a, in a program and you can spawn a ton of these and then just go and attack everybody. So, uh, that's just one example. Let's take a look at uh, one more. Let's see, here is altcoin daily. Let's scroll down. And, uh, again, <sighs> Usually the first one, it's not. Oh, there is one here. I don't know, Dijon Mac. Thanks for your comments. Oh, that's stupid. And then here's another one, uh, Al Lovers. And then see, here we go. Altcoin daily offer. Let's look over here. V2 more replies. No, nothing. V2 replies. Here's another one, Altcoin daily. Again, if we click on this, what's it going to show? It's going to show uh, some ridiculous uh, name with no videos, no plays, no, no, no content or anything. And then, of course, this, like I said, this account is linked to a specific email that they use to create this account too. So when Graham over here was talking about how, uh, you know, they, they sent him an email and like, well, he's like, well, it's all because of the Graham Stephen. That's not, that's not the case. I think it's a little bit different. And I think it is a little bit like this. So what do you do? Well, first of all, when you're taking a look at all these things, um, you have to think to yourself, well, what is happening in the background here? If you have all these different scams and all these different things, YouTube just starts to look at this and go, and I think they're just overwhelmed with their algorithm. So whatever it is, it's up to you to protect your account uh, and however you do that. So there's a couple of ways. You can manually delete all these things, but uh, over at uh, Paul Barone Network, where he's only got like 50,000 subscribers, he hired a guy to do this 40 hours a week. So Graham Steven here has, has 3 million subscribers. I'm pretty sure he gets a lot more, more views. And I'm sh pretty sure he gets a lot more scams. So if he's manually deleting himself, that's impossible. Even if he hires a team, that would be a waste, in my personal opinion, because uh, who's got that kind of time? Uh, maybe Graham does, I don't know. And then uh, also you can do this. You can just say, and some people in the comment section will say, well, just get off the platform, just just leave YouTube. YouTube sucks anyhow. And they're, you know, the, they're the great overlords and Google and down with them. And sure, look, you can go to another platform like a, like a, a Cinnamon. You can go to even like, like a Theta. I got Theta and it works out pretty well. But just so you know, 
uh, on my channel, on, I've got two channels, Digital Asset News Clips, which is a smaller channel at 15,000 subscribers. We've also got Digital Asset News, which is the daily news. We're coming up on 250,000 subscribers. And with those two, like on this channel, some it's a, it's a crapshoot. Who knows how many I get? Sometimes it's like uh, 500, sometimes it's like 30,000. Over on Dan, just the regular channel, we'll get between 30,000 and 70,000 views pretty much every single every single video. So if uh, if you if I want to take that over to another platform, I've done this before, and I get uh, like between 10 and 200 views depending on the, on the different platforms that I do. So YouTube is hands down the best place to get your message uh, across. And that's just really how, what it comes down to. So what do you do to combat this algorithm to stop YouTube looking at your channel and going, wow, there's so many spam comments in here and they're all from Graham Stephen. And maybe we're gonna associate Graham Stephen with what's going on in his channel because Graham Stephen, maybe you should just do what I do. And I just use this thing called YouTube Guard, YT Guard. And uh, I do not get compensation for this company. There's a link in the description and the, the link is ytguard.com. It's no affiliate link or anything like that. If I do send some people and they use the code Dan, they get like a two weeks uh, uh, evaluation and I get a small percentage off my uh, monthly fee that I have to pay because I have paid for this service because three months ago I was so sick of all these different uh, scammers being on the channel. And if you'll notice in my in my uh, profile or in my in my comment section, it's clean. In the first two weeks, it was 70% reduction of spam. And after that, like three, four weeks and moving on, about 95% of my spam comments are gone. Why did I do it? Because I hate scammers and I hate people missing out and getting screwed out of all their money. And I can tell you every single video of what to watch out for. And you gotta check out this out. First of all, it'll go over people's heads. Second of all, they'll say, I didn't, I didn't hear it. And then third of all, if I say it in the beginning or the middle of the end, like I didn't hear that part. So sorry. So you have to do something to protect people because they're vulnerable. And that's just how it is. And uh, that's why I use YT Guard. And also it's better for me. And I reached out to uh, numerous crypto, almost all of them, crypto YouTubers. So if you're going to crypto YouTube and you're looking uh, in their section, there's one of two things. Uh, I'll just say it like this. It's either they don't know, they didn't, they didn't get my message because I'm, I'm not, I'm just, I'm just some guy, right? And they just didn't know about it. Or second, they just don't give a crap uh, about the um, comments that are there because they don't really care about the subscribers. Or the last one is this, they're just like Graham. They have no idea how to, how to combat it and they are overwhelmed because there's nothing they can do. They think there's nothing they can do. And now you know that there is something you can do. You can use this. So if you're watching this video and you are pissed off about all the different scammers and spam and everything else like that, or you've heard stories of people getting screwed over, or you want to actually protect or help some of your favorite YouTubers, share this video and just put it out there. Let them know what it is. It's uh, YT Guard. I am not the owner. I don't do anything with this. These guys just reached out to me. They're very good. Uh, they work uh, with YouTube to help and actually try to combat these spammers and they are great at what they do. But again, there's no uh, affiliate link. It's just ytguard.com. Links in the description and that's it. So, hey, thanks for watching. I know it's a little bit off, off topic, but uh, it's one of those things I think I feel like I should actually do. And that's it. So thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, thumbs up, subscribe, all that great stuff. See you in the next one.